everyone, and my name's Al from Games Rip. Today, we are going to be delving into the world of Half-Life on the Sega Dreamcast as a Doom mod. That's right, there is a Half-Life Doom mod for the Sega Dreamcast. Should we take a look? Let's do it, Gordon. I've got to say, I've got such a love for Doom. Doom mods, because, let's face it, Doom is the godfather of all FPSs, and then when you merge it with another absolute gem of an FPS, aka Half-Life, you get Doom Half-Life, and as you can start off by saying, this game pretty much starts exactly how Half-Life does, it plays, the game actually plays out exactly like Half-Life, yeah okay with a few adjustments, it's missing a lot of, of the, the narration and the character speech, but it obviously still maintains what Half-Life is in essence. But with the Doom engine, the Doom movement, you can tell this is a Doom mod, just the way it works. And let's face it, listen to the music. It sounds like Doom music. Now, it's a shame they obviously didn't include the microwave incident. But let's face it, you know, screw it. It's a Doom mod. You can't really be pulling off the sort of stuff you we or we would have seen back when Half-Life 1 came out. Now the cool thing what they've done with the music is they've also got, well if you can remember the music when you got into the HEV suit on the PC version, they've done a kind of Doom-esque remix of it as you can hear right here. Well, this is what it used to sound like on top of what you're seeing right here. Okay, yeah, it, it is better than the Doom sounding of the squeals, yeah, don't get me wrong. But again, let's not forget, this is a Doom mod. And as you can see here, this game does very much create the visuals of Half-Life 1 in the Doom style. And it does it really, really well. As you can see, we're entering the Chamber of Death, I call it, where shit goes down. But, yeah... It's done in a slightly different style, so much so here I thought the crate was going to come up. Does it? No, no it does not. It kind of goes to kind of a little flash sequence where you see the aliens, where you're kind of being morphed or essentially teleported into a different area and then bang, you're here after it all goes wrong. It's, it's weird, but <laughs> very, very strange. And it's about to get a whole lot stranger and I'll tell you how Yep, yeah, the size of the head crabs. Are you ready? Yeah? There it is! That is one big head crab. And they all show it as that size in this mod. It's really, really strange. Quite discombobulating. That's a word, isn't it? Quite discombobulating. As you can look at that, it just doesn't look quite right. So they got the scales a little bit wrong there, but hey, you know, it doesn't really bother me. Again, this is a sequence where someone's turning into a zombie with a head crab. And yeah, you cannot, for some reason, certain points use the health points. They just don't, don't seem to work, and some things do seem to work. It's a bit of an odd mod. It kind of feels a little bit not quite finished. But, as you can see here, these zombies look great, and they seem to work really, really well. And you're going to see exactly the same thing with the military in a minute. And the military personnel are exactly the same. They look correct, and, you know, that's how it should be. Now, the weaponry is pretty, pretty decent here. The machine gun's good. As you can see, it's got the skin of the machine gun in the Half-Life game, although they call it a minigun here. But I think the shotgun is the best weapon at your disposal in this game. Very much like Doom normally is, shotgun pretty much rules all, and it, you can tell that in this mod. Now again, this is another added creature you just saw then, uh, an invisible zombie. They're kind of, they're a bit loose with the source material, but loose, but also close. Does that make any sense? And when I say that, I kind of mean that basically, They've done the main story, but kind of 
switched it around to fit in a new mod. It looks great, and let's face it, you do end up going to Zen as well. That's right. Anyway, I've been Al from Games Rip. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you all soon.